just gotta tell you this one thing vlogs here back again with another video today um we're gonna be going to uh swansea city versus west Bramble channel we are done at liberty stadium the last time even though it might be a good person for swansea laughing uh for west brom um i could see this going one way unfortunately i've got to say west brom win um, I'm going to take you to, to West Brom with her, West Brom with Bruce Khan and, and for us, I'm going to say uh, Bruce and Gallagher. So, um, if you do enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Also, vote for me in the FCA's next week. It'll be much appreciated as well. So, uh, let's head down to Liberty Stadium. Come on, you swans. Who are you? Just in the uh, KFC now, joined by him. Uh, Dub, big Dub, in the KFC. Uh, as you can see here in the words of the fallen chapter, God rest his channel soul. Uh, I'm joining a lovely bungless banquet going on on football Twitter um, about um, which which uh, chips are better for me. God be a KFC chip, I know. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. And, and he's dropped this fork. Rest in peace. Oh, Dad, this is for you. He's coming back. He's got a new fork. New fork. <coughs> yeah. Can't shake your hand today. I know. Oh, look at that. Lovely stuff. Doesn't Let's look get... nice. Eight point five. That is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so obviously we just come back from KFC. Yeah, we reviewed your mashed potato. Yeah, we reviewed my mashed potato. So score production, anyways, please. Knock off, Frank and go. Like I said, with Curtis just now, three 0 West Brom. I think their squad's way too strong for us. I think we're getting a lot of injuries now. Garrick is ill. I don't think he's fully fit. Yeah, he hasn't trained all week, so you know that's a risk starting. But we got no one else really. Fino West Brom, Hal Robson, kind of a brace, and Matthias Pereira. Um, can't just get anything out of this, and I think honestly, I think we're going to see three in the first half. We're just more confident like today. The whole four. Yeah, yeah, yeah they, we, all, we they all just got it. Really we, we all went there, didn't we? Yeah. We saw that. I, th I blame the pink there, so uh, yeah. Very sad, and then we're out. Yeah. But score production, anyway. Well, um, well, West Brom, obviously, they lost to Wigan last week. Well, I'm a little confident, but not confident at the same time, so I'm quite mixed, to be honest with you. But um, obviously, um, West Brom, sometimes, they, sometimes they're bad, sometimes they're good. Well, most of the time they're good. But um, to be honest with you, since I'm like a bit of conf a bit confident and a bit not confident, I think we could get a point out of this 1 1 draw. I reckon Rian Brewster for us, I reckon Robinson for West Brom Chalvian. But you got to think, Simon Billich, he's got a good record against us. As obviously, he beat, he beat, when West Ham in the Premier League, obviously, he was there. They beat us numerous times. But, um, yeah, yeah. come on, Sean. What, what are your opinions on those horses? Of course. Yeah. Subscribe. Old Town Road. <laughs> he's singing Old Town Road. I hope I don't get copyrighted on yeah. that. Alright, how long does it have to be? Any. Born in the USA. Born in the USA. Young <laughs> 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 uh, Yeah, good. Swansea, 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 Swans
standing on the north bank till the day I die. Take me to the next field with a man, and I will fall of Swansea, Swansea City. New Jack Bristol City column right now. Uh, last two minutes, it's Bristol City 1, column 1. What are your thoughts? Yeah, I'm hoping this ends up a draw because obviously Bristol City can catch the win today as oh, we're going to have to close that with Fulham. Eliasson's coming on. Yeah, Eliasson, he's, he's caught in the case. And going off, it looks like Naki Wells. Naki Wells, yeah. Okay. Who got the goals? What are the on Bristol City's kit? Bristol City, hmm. So it looks like a tractor. <laughs> Explains a lot. Yeah. Well, right, Naki Wells, he's actually scored the goal for Bristol City and Kearney got the Fulham one. Naki yeah. Wells scored, did he? Yeah, Wells for Bristol and Kearney for Fulham. Kearney. Number 27, Freddie Wellman, 26, Kyle Norton, 4, Joe Rhoda, 44, Ben Cabango, 24, Jack Bedwell, 6, Jay Fulton, 8, Matt Grimes, 18, Aldo Canoon, 33, Conor Gallagher, 22, Andre Ayo, who was uh, ruled out due to um, injury, but it's now starting. And number 19, Rio Brewster. Who were taking risks, so that's it. I, I didn't want him to be to start, but he got to the because of risks, you know. And then on the bench, 25, Aaron Mulder, 23, Conor Roberts, 20, Ben Wilmot. Yeah, um, number 21, Jan Danda, 12, Nathan Dyer, 13, Leon Callum, my thoughts? Only six subs. Yeah. One more sub, is it? Yeah, Garrett. six subs, not... It was supposed to be Like, Garrett. basically, we're going to be using half our subs. Yeah. Unless if we're allergic to making three of them, like we've been doing in the past. Yeah. What are you debating here? Uh, six subs. At the end of the day, there's not many more first teamers who can play, really. Um, at the end of the day, who else could you put on the bench who's got first some experience? Yeah, I know. Just because there's, there's no one really, is there? No. So, I would have liked one of the other players, maybe Keys to Pua. Um, possibly even Tivon's Rashia, maybe him. But you know, I believe in Cooper, so he's oh, getting three uh, points. Goodbye. Oh, please, and Joseph. One nil swans, big. Clean sheet. What are your thoughts on West Brom's turnout? Fair play. But, uh, I got the same feeling. She Sheffield United last year, they were in the fight. For their level performance at a 1-0 win, I'm feeling the same. Yeah. Here's the West
Review. Oh, Jake stole a chip. Eight point one. Eight point one. Like the fog data yeah. beer reviews. The bacon's lovely. Yeah. The lovely. yeah. And the, che the cheese is well drizzled as well. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's not bad. I had to try myself. Uh, yeah. uh, Reese Bish uh, swallowed away those yard forks on the south. Uh, it's been decent to be honest, uh, defensively we've been quite solid. We're not getting many chances to win forward, but we're not getting, but we're not, we're not, we're not getting the ball. When we get the ball, we just come it, so we'd like to see a bit better tactic put on the floor. But I think we can't get around West Brom's defence, but like I said, they're very solid and they're not going to for a reason. So, definitely take a draw at the end of the game, but I've got a bad feeling. As soon as West Brom get one, we're going to get anything more. Um, who do you think is the best threat for West Brom? I'd probably say the best bet so far is Pereira. His yeah. touch has been very good. Yeah, we can't be giving him space like. Yeah. I think Kravanovic as well. He's getting a lot of space in the ball as well, but he's just keeping it. So yeah. definitely Pereira. They're a clinical side, you see. Cam Robinson, well, you're fortunate. Yeah, he's a good winger. Good winger. <laughs> well, um, not too shabby, to be honest with you. Well, obviously, uh, West Brom, their cross has been excellent. And. Um, I think um, at the end of the game, I just happily take the little, little draw because um, West Brom, as you can see, they're obviously they're the top side and um, we're, doing, we're defending really well at the moment. And we've had a few chances ourselves, so hopefully we can actually get the three points. But if we win, then that will keep our chances of the playoffs alive. But the thing is, we're pressing to win in against QPR. It's not good, but Bristol City did um, didn't didn't win against um, Fulham, so. Yeah, hopefully we can get the three points. If we win, it will be a massive victory. Championship score predictions this weekend is going to be very yep. interesting. Yep, I will be um, featuring, but um, I'll be sending my predictions on the card. Yeah, obviously because yeah. he loves it for Talbot. So yeah. There's no health and safety on it. Yeah. You can easily get burned. That's the only problem with it. Yeah. This week I'm going to give a six. A vast improvement from last week. Vast improvement. Right. We got a free kick here. Matt Brown. What are you saying for this? I think it's crossed the goal, but no point tripping it in because it's Kyle Bartley's in there. Yeah. Low and out. Low and out. Hopefully, someone can get their head on it. Uh, so I'm sitting now, what's wrong now? What's the point, uh, especially for the top of the league team anyway? Uh, we uh, performed well defensively. Um, I thought Freddie Wilmer was really tested or anything. But, but the thing is, right, we got we got to be able to finish chances. I, I reckon there's a few chances we could have put away. But in all fairness, we did get a point. Uh, three points off the playoffs now, which is good. 
uh, can see us being in a uh, run in for the end of the season. But uh, only time could tell. Thanks, QPR, for being.